here we go. I'll just say hello. Why not? Why not? Why not? G'day everyone. Uh, my name is Chrissy. Thanks for joining here at X Resort. I'm just going to be working on my painting. It'll just be nice and easy music. Uh, not much chat this time. So if you have any questions, I, I have um, Janice is in the chat, so she'll be able to relay some of these um, messages to me. Um, so here we go. Uh, just adjusting here. Need to record. Start recording. And start recording here. Hey, Suju. Hey, Cherry. Hello. Thought I'd, you know, I thought, well, I need to finish this. So I thought, like I said on Wednesday, I'm going to see if I can live stream on Sunday. And here we go. So... Juanita, Dean, hello, Kathy, Kathy, hello. All right, I am organised. Um, so just bear with me. I've just been painting a little bit of fur and I'm working on the hair. I want to work on the hair today. So just checking with my brushes and have pan colours close by. looking at my reference Trying to resist blowing. <laughs> Every time I think I stop, I try to stop myself. But Vicky, Marcy, hello, welcome, welcome. Yeah, um, yeah. This one, this stream is just well. I'm um, I I work most weekends, not all, but most weekends. And I thought, you know, like I, I mentioned that I um uh, that I might live stream like a working stream maybe on Sunday so I thought well I want to finish this so 
Um, yeah, I won't be chatting so much, but I've got um, Janice. Thank you. Um, saying thank you to Janice again, who's moderating the stream. If she's um, if you've got questions, um, I'll just um, keep on working, and she'll ask them um, and relay them to me as I'm painting, and I can answer them for you. So, um, or just sit back and just take it easy. So uh, what time here? It's 20 to 10 or 9.40 a.m. in the morning Eastern Aussie Standard Time here. So um, it's Northern Hemisphere. It's night time. So Saturday. Oh, Marcy, you're in hospital. I hope you're okay. You know, get well soon. I hope it's nothing, not too serious. So take it easy, my dear. Hmm. I'm just thinking colours now. Let's just put that aside. What I'm trying to do is take this as much as I possibly can uh, to the max with the um, with the pans. Uh, I have worked a little bit with the pastel pencils here because I was happy with what I had done on the face but um, the hair, I, I want to get away from the face for a little while and just work on the hair a little bit so make sure my hair's not being um, in the camera on my left here which is my main problem all the time. Um, uh, okay, what am I thinking while I'm doing this? Uh, what I'm thinking... Um, um, the reference that I'm using is only just a guide. Uh, once I've got the... It's mostly the proportions that all, I always think about. I like to, um, uh, you know, although this is a royalty free image and I can use it, um, I also like to change it too, you know, add my little spin on it. So, um, um, and I do want to make her hair sort of look like hair. I don't want it to look like uh, fur. So that's the, um, well, that's the, the aim. Um, These are the brushes that I like to use, these fine ones, one that I've chopped up, there we go. Um, going medium here, medium value, um, before I go light. and much her hair is like pulled back so you might even get to hear the birds 
I'm not sure. I've sort of I've closed the door ish, and then they're around. So if they, Heidi, hello, Heidi, welcome. Uh, yeah, just a working stream here. Who knows, I might even get to finish this today. Let's see how long I can stay on. There's no real time. I'm just going to be here for a little while. Um, don't know, maybe two or three hours, maybe. Um, so for those popping in and out, I'll be around for a little while. Angie, Angie, is it Angie? Hey, oh, hey Angie, hello my dear, how are you going? Yeah, this is a working stream, so... Um, it's probably a little bit different to the normal Wednesday streams and the... Of course the... So. This is where... Um, I just um, sit and paint, listen to music, maybe uh, hope this music isn't too boring for you. <laughs> uh, I'm making the, um, It's. I'm not going to make her hair, look, sorry Heidi, I'm trying to answer your question. Um, the hair is going, sorry, is it Kathy? Sorry, Kathy. Um, uh, I'm going to make it look like hair. Um, not fur, but I want the colours to sort of match the um, her her colouring on her face. So, um, but the it will look like hair. Hopefully, when I finish. <laughs> oh yeah. Angie, you hear the birds? Yeah. Soon we're going to have maybe some kookaburras around. Who knows? Kookaburras and cockatoos, the cockies. They just come out and be a menace. They're menaces. They're beautiful, but they're... The cockies, I mean. They're beautiful with their sulphur-crested, you know, um, feathers. But um, they're a nuisance. You wouldn't want to have plants and trees they start to knock off <laughs> all the fruit from the trees um. got a bit of a halo around just like there's light just behind her head so um, so I just want to see if I can capture just that little shine on the back with a lighter value not too much but got to do her ears. Maybe after the hair. And I get back to the face. Just making sure that I've got record. Okay, yep, I do. Oh, thank 
hair in my arm. said Belinda oh Belinda oh, Li oh hello L Linda hi Linda how you going welcome is this just a watch stream or a watch and listen stream uh, it's a watch but um, uh, watch and yeah pretty much watch um, if you've got questions I'll, uh, Janice is in the chat and she can um, um, uh, relay your questions uh, but yeah, quite happy to answer questions if you've got any. Um, yeah, it's pretty much, I, I usually work on weekends and um, I, I did promise to, well, so, well, I didn't quite promise, but um, I mentioned that I was going to uh, live stream, see how I go on, a, on the weekend. And, um, and it's probably more of a working stream, yeah. But yeah, no, you can answer que you can ask questions. pencils here now.
Heidi, thank you for your question. Um, using airbrush instead of pastel mats um, and does it save time? Um, okay, oh, and will I be doing that in the future? I probably um, will only do it from time to time um, and I'm finding that as much as it's you get a really nice effect with the airbrushing, uh, I can equally get a lovely effect with the pans goes without saying um, so I think in future uh, because first of all the um, because I like to use pastel mat um, uh, it it does fill the tooth up much quicker than it would than when I use the pants I've got to be honest with you there uh, I don't know why it I suppose it's wet media and it fills, I suppose, that's maybe why it fills the tooth. So I'm only going to do it only from time to time. Um, and I'd like to be able to use, now that, I mean, of course, and plus um, on pastel mat, it, it, it's not the same as it would if, if I was using, say, a hot press paper. So... Uh, so in that case, well, I'm not going to probably use pans on hot press paper, although I'm never going to say never. So, um, but I'll f I find that um, the airbrushing it does uh, it does fill the tooth, and that's not so. Then yeah, um, I I don't like to always think in my mind that I've got limited layers. I I always like to think in my mind, okay, well I've got lots of layers. I know how it works. Um, so, but in future projects using airbrush, it'll be more towards using with coloured pencil. Definitely coloured pencil. I'm thinking of doing um, a coloured pencil project um, on the Derwent Light Fast paper. Um, I've got a sheet uh, which I want to try before I purchase a whole pad because I know it's damn well expensive. So I'd like to do a coloured pencil piece um, using the airbrush for a background. So good question. I like that. I don't know if I answered it. Did I? Did I? Um, I the uh, no. I got my reference photo from uh, deposit photos. This is a, a royalty-free um, subscription-based uh, site. It's another place to get your um, uh, references from. Uh, then there's licenses in which you purchase them with. You know, you can... Yeah, so there's ways then you can use this. Uh, the background... Um, I can't remember whether it was Pixabay. I think the background was Pixabay. Oh, it's it's one of the Pixabay or deposit photos. It's one of the two. Um, I have to have a look later in my notes. So when I'm when I'm posting it, um, I'll say it. Hair is always tricky, isn't it? Because 
there's curls, there's highlights, there's um, in particular this one in particular. She's just got her hair slicked back. You know, she might as well be bald. <laughs> so, but anyway, well, bald with dark hair. <laughs> I'm using a Conti black, but um, and they're all different feels. Uh, the black that I usually like to use is uh, the uh, it's not here. It's my Geocondas. Well, because they're different softness, you see. So I might have to get up and get it. But the Carbothellos are kind of like um, in between there. I think they've got in between soft and hard, I think. If you're going to have an all-rounder, I reckon that would be it. Hang on, my husband's just here. I've just got the door ajar. You can probably hear him chatting. Hang on a sec. Find my G Conda. <laughs> Can't find it. Oh well, I'll have to make do with what I've got. It's probably around here somewhere. Can't be too far away. Can you? Yes, I, yes. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. Maybe my charcoal black. Yes, hang on a sec. Hang on a sec. some um, generals charcoal is it peel and sketch they're extremely black so um, I've got these on hand so see how we go See what I'm doing. Um, hmm. Ah, thank you, Kathy. Yeah. 
Thank you, Kathy. Yeah, the hair. I'm trying to match the hair. Make it look like it belongs. <laughs> to, yeah, exactly like a lioness. Well, that's nice and black. And I'm using... <laughs> I'm using extreme, extreme light pressure. Extreme. And that's one of the issues that we have sometimes, isn't it? That we're... Um, Oh, bugger. It's, um, you know, we want it. Sometimes we want to get black, 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 black. And sometimes the normal pastels, or depends, just don't give us that rich black. Whereas. And there's always the fear of making it muddy, isn't it? So that I'm thinking of that too. Um. And of course, you know, my scratchy Derwent pastel pencils. I've got to stop whinging about them because I used them. <laughs> you know, can't whinge and use them at the same time. Uh, and I just love the colours, that's the thing. They just have some really nice colours. You know what I can't wait? I can't wait to do this thing that comes up from our eyebrows. It's this it's like this whiskers eyebrow thing. Like I'm just itching to do it. But I know that I can't do it just yet. But oh I'm itching. called patience something I don't have much of and I'm I'm getting better at it I'm getting better at patience Uh, yes, Kathy, I agree with you. The black sometimes feels like it's not dark enough. Yes, and that's why sometimes we've got to pull out these. But yes, extremely good for when, if you've got, say, if you've got, um, yeah, darkening. Oh, how many times do we use that to darken um, uh, certain pan colours? Particularly if you've got the the uh, pure colours. Um, Uh, you know, uh, making something darker. Yes, I agree. So that's why we've got to improvise, hey?
Oh, Sally, hello. Nice to see you here. Yeah, oh, that's great. Yes, um, Sally is talking about Patreon. Uh, we've got a, a simple, uh, a simple uh, portrait. I decided um, I, I was, I had, I had a mashup ready, but it was. Um, I, I think it was really, it was going to be difficult. And so I thought, but we're going to do something like that for sure. We're going to do it. But what I wanted to do is just to do something easy first. And, uh, and we're going to put uh, some of our, some of the studies or the practices that we've done uh, to test with this one. It's nice and simple. Um, and can I also just say too, like uh, Sally, thank you for bringing that up. Uh, sometimes uh, this particular portrait has uh, two main colors. If you don't, and in any, like in any of the subjects that I do, if you don't have the main colors, we can improvise or we can mix. And then I can show you how to mix. If you're not, if you're not comfortable with mixing, um, because sometimes mixing it, um, sometimes it comes across as quite simple but sometimes it's not you know so um, it's not so that's why um, yeah I, I just wanted to stress that it's it's not always easy because you've got to figure out you know the values and and what makes what what color makes what so yes but so if you don't have the colors uh, definitely um, uh, improvise Alright, so I'm just going to leave the hair alone for a moment. I'm going to come back to her with the hair. Uh, let's do her ears. Yeah, she's got no ears at the moment, poor thing. <laughs> so let's just put that charcoal aside, charcoal aside. Ears. And of course we've done ears on in Patreon. We've done eyes. We've done, well, the mouth, the nose, but yeah, so these are like good practice when you're doing portraits. These are the things that I'll always be doing. So, so bring back my little, um, put my um, pastel pencils aside. And because I've got glassine, I'm, I feel very confident that I'm not ruining my background. So anyway. Uh, Sally, all is good. Uh, no problem at all. We're going to go step by step. And if you've only got eight pans, red, white and blue, perfect. All good. I'll show you how to mix. I've just got to warn you guys that my husband is working outside in the shed, so he'll try to behave himself, try to keep quiet, but you know, no promises. So <laughs> he's usually good when I am um, live stream, but.
stuff. Trying to figure out why this doesn't look right for me, but I've just figured it out. Uh, this needs value, different value. That's why values are important. Just makes things look off when it's not right. And I can see where it looks off sometimes. Sometimes I don't see it, and then it gets pointed out to me. Happens a lot. Because you know you're looking at something all the time, and you've been looking at it too much.
Steve, hello. Oh, it's Steve, no, Sneaks. Sneaks, Sneaks, hello. Sorry, Deb. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Hi, Deb. Yes, uh, yes, I do. Um, okay, what's uh, Janice is moderating the stream. This is, and she's relaying, um, she's relaying uh, when you want to ask me something or if there's something that you wanted to talk about that you want me to hear, or um, she'll make me, Janice will let me know and I'll look up, or um, yeah, it's just a, a working stream. Um, because I usually work on week most weekends, not all, but most weekends, and uh, because I talk and I talked about last Wednesday how I was going to maybe live stream, and so uh, I really would like to finish um, this lovely lady. Um, so I thought, well, you know, why don't I just do a, a working? Why don't I just do a, a working stream? And um, yeah, so yeah, but I do, <laughs> I do it, you know. You know, I love you all. <laughs> I love you all. But yeah, so I thought... Um, I'd like to do more Sundays, if I can. Um, not quite sure if it's instead of Wednesdays, but you know, there's things can change so <laughs> well, you know I love you Deb Yeah, this charcoal is really good for making things black, black, black. And I mean black. I 
I ended up using, I remember using this, ah, bugger. <laughs> oh, God. It had to happen. Hang on, I've got to vacuum this because I might do something horrible. delicate isn't it well it's too long you know serves me serves me right hey hey Helen hello my dear hope you're well hello Wendy welcome Okay, Helen, you're at work. Wow. This must be night shift for you then. It's got to be night shift. Okay. Um, all right, so I'm going to work on here and then I'll come, come back into the face I think I need to do that to gauge my values because she's nowhere near finished here so um, let's put those aside for the moment and work out colors put that away put... okay I want to use that I want to use that I want to use that <sighs> Zoom out so you can see what I'm doing. Okay. Let's just zoom out here. Let's zoom out. God, I hope my hair is not in this bit of footage. <sighs> I know I complain about it. All right, here we go. At this point, I can use a, a soft tool, but I'm electing not to. I want to control this part uh, with the amount of layers, and it's easy for me to do it with the brush. Well, for me anyway. As you can see, it's slow. That's all right. Is that question for everyone? Sorry. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Deb, very good question. And I'll, uh, where is it? Uh, 
I have a question for everyone. Why do you use pastels as opposed to other mediums? What made you decide? <clears throat> well, I can tell you what, how, uh, for me, how it worked. Uh, uh, when I got back into art, I, I was using oils. And I've got some really beautiful pieces of oils. But what I found, uh, first of all, I found that um, uh, because I, uh, I painted, say, on the weekends and... And sometimes, like, uh, I might not get back to it until, you know, um, the week after. And so, therefore, it would dry. Although oils, you know, it takes a long time for them to dry, granted. But I used to use, and sometimes, I, I a lot of the times, I would use the, the quick drying medium to mix in. So, therefore, things used to dry real quick for me. Uh, sorry, um, as a, for oils, that is. And... Um, I think what it all boiled down to is that I'll, you know, uh, I didn't want to wait because this is how I would paint if I was painting with oils, the, the same way. I would paint the same way, and uh, so I wanted to find another medium which uh, which I could try. So I started with soft pastels, and I mean I haven't used soft pastels for a very long time, but. Um, but that's uh, and then you know then I discovered the pans of course and and I liked the way that the pans made me feel like I was working as if I was working wet do you know what I mean but I didn't have to wait for it to dry so and plus I wanted to try a new medium and so that was the, the next uh, the next medium that I tried and I just fell in love with soft pastels so quick like I'm thinking wow and the only thing that um, that held me, the only thing that I kept on getting annoyed with was um, in the beginning, uh, before I discovered pastel mat, was the uh, you know the muddiness. I was trying to figure out the muddiness and um, uh, and layers and stuff like that, and, and I ended up trying fixative. And then when I use fixative, I go, oh my gosh, this is so bad. It just, I just, I was gutted most of the time. So I tried to work a way, or I had to figure out a way how to not use pastel mat. So I was discovering lots of papers and that's how I discovered pastel mat. And then I discovered, actually, I think I discovered pastel mat first. And then um, I discovered then the pans. I don't know if that's a good enough answer <laughs> but that's what happened to me I don't know how everyone else is I'd be interested to to find out how what makes uh, people like the mediums that they do because you know this is pastels there are people that just will not touch anything but acrylics will not touch anything but oils do you know what I mean like it's just um, it's a preference isn't it and how quickly you discover how how it works I think that also is something um, as soon as if you can figure how if you can figure how something works pretty quickly when I say quickly not just the first session I mean you know after playing around and go oh yeah okay so this is how this works then that's when you start to um, you know, you start liking it and then you start figuring it out very quickly. Yeah, I think it's, I think that plays a part too. I'm not sure. Started with oils over 30 years ago, saw an amazing pastel painting in Beechworth and so tried pastels two years ago. Sticks first, uh, but so messy, prefer pan. Mm. Yeah. And I think there's that too. Pans aren't as messy as the soft pastels got to tell you my hands are mostly clean if I'm using the pans there's that mm. okay uh, I'm going to blend that bit in I just wanted to that's what's going to happen there that's why I left it like that um, but I won't just do that yet have to 
get the black out. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay, Helen. Great. Look forward to seeing it. Uploading your video. Oh, your son is uploading your video. Terrific. Wonderful. Oh, your compressor died? Oh, that's just like your lifeline. Uh, but getting a new one, that's good. <laughs> yeah, yeah. What compressor do you have, Helen? Mine's the Awada Studio Series one. I don't know what that means in airbrush land. Um, <laughs> but it works nice. Although yours is getting probably more of a workout, so. Does a compressor die? How does it die? Is it from overuse? Oh, Steve, hello, my friend. I wonder if you're okay. Hope you're feeling okay. This one I won't subject you to the noise. Okay, Helen, bye for now. Talk to you soon. So this is where it has to blend out in this area here. Okay. Steve, I hope things are okay over there in Texas for you. Well, Steve, oh well, at least you've got power. It's 
also devastating, isn't it, when you've got to do these things? The weather is one thing that we can... Or Mother Nature is one thing that we cannot run away from. Yeah. So I hope you're okay. interesting I'm trying to get this really dark underneath the ch underneath the chin do you think underneath the chin do you think I can get it dark enough oh it's because the other colors underneath are influencing the black and that's why that's what that's the thing with the pants so I've got to use maybe charcoal to make certain areas dark That's the tricky part too when you're blending some two separate things like this to make it look like it's part of the painting. I mean, I suppose it is fantasy, so you know, anything is possible. Okay, cool, I like that. Ah, bugger again. got a little bit of fur on her skin there on her so I'm gonna see how we go with fur on her and this will be interesting <laughs> she's gonna have a five o'clock shadow there you go <laughs> I like that <laughs> all right let's see how we go Okay. 
Pastel pencils come out again. Fur's going everywhere. Going this way and that way, this way, that way. So. And feather light. Short fur. She's got short. It's short. And this part, and this part, there's no fur. So just have to.
notes, but it's, ne it's nearly my morning. Well, it is my morning tea break, but um, um, but that's okay. Might get a little coffee a little later on. <laughs> Steve, that's very funny. <laughs> Janice just told me what you said.
just going to leave that for the moment. I'm going to work on her face. See if I can get uh, some fur on her face. And of course, I'm giving the suggestion that there's fur on her body. So it doesn't necessarily have to be all covered with fur. Um, so here we go. Um, just here. Hi Nanette, what a surprise this is. Hello, yes it is. Well, thought I would um, stream. So where's your glass of wine Nanette? <laughs> thought you'd have a glass of wine ready for me. Uh, yes, I do. Uh, sorry, do I have, do I have it in my head? Yes, I do. Um, I want to show the um, the impression that she's got fur, but not that she's going to be covered with fur. Um, um, uh, um, but I would like to show um, fur on her face. So that's. Um, but but yes, I, I do have it in my head. Um, I do have it in my head, but then something clicks sometimes, and I go, well, "What happens if I do this?" And then I try it, and because pastels are a bit forgiving, I can erase, and there's not a problem. Um, but in most cases, yeah. You're having dinner, waffles, mmm, lovely. Nanette. <laughs> White wine pairs well with waffles, okay, cool. <laughs> oh, oh, which, oh, which wine, oh, what, pa oh, what pairs, um, well, I would say a nice um, musket, if you ask me, or a delicious port. That's what would go well with that, if you have it. Oh, ah, oh, Steve, you're gonna make 
Steve, you, you're making me blush for a start, um, but um, it's welcome, by the way. Um, are you losing? No, I'm not losing. Well, no, you know what? I think it's the angle of the camera, to be honest. But if I'm looking younger, it could be the um, it could be the hair. I've, I'm pretty sure it's the hair. It's got to be the hair. I can't. Um, I'm going lighter. There's a reason why I'm going lighter, because I'm getting older. <laughs> Hi, Shandri. Hello, sweetheart. How are you going? <laughs> yeah, that's the the reason actually. <laughs> I'm going lighter because I'm getting older. Uh, yeah. Well, by nature, I'm actually a brunette, to be honest. I'm a brunette. So. Um, but as you get older, you know, your hair colour changes. Everything. Everything changes. <laughs> Short fur here, yeah. just very short. But remember to do the other side similar because uh, before I lose track of what I've done on one side. Um, hello, my mother. Um, nice kitty. Yes, thank you. Um, oh, okay. I am not allowed outside since I'll. Um, I was 12 or you are 12? Uh, 43 now. Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Mm hmm.
okay this is nearly done what's up next um uh, oh, that's a good question uh, oh excuse me i just want to hold on a sec um uh, I've got, uh, well, uh, I'm trying to finish some projects, to be honest. I'm just trying to finish some projects. But um, I'm looking at, um, uh, well, I've got a my fantasy, my fantasy wood one I haven't finished yet. So I've actually got to uh, put some time into that. So I might, I have to finish that uh, before I do anything that I've planned. And it's um, a, a fantasy landscape. That's what's next. Uh, but I've got to make sure that I finish most. I don't mind having, say, two or three on the go. But I don't want to have too much on the go. Because then it might become a little bit overwhelming. So I've got to finish. But yeah, fantasy landscape coming up. Oh yes, and of course you know there's Patreon, um, which I'm which I work on, so Heaven forbid she might finish life. <laughs> uh, yes, you know, heaven forbid. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> Is that possible? It doesn't happen very often, but you never know. Uh, I've got mashups to do, uh, but... Um, no, I'm going to do a fantasy landscape. Is anyone going to do mashups? There's a question. Thank you, Heidi. Yep. Of course, it'll be. I was about to say weird and wonderful, but you know, I don't know about wonderful, but how about interesting? Okay, Cherry, thank you, sweetheart, for popping by. It's nice that you kept me company. I'm just around. It'd be late in the UK, wouldn't it? It'd be if it's eleven thirty here. It must be like the early hours of the morning there. Twelve thirty. Hmm.
just you know the whiskers I can't wait to do the whiskers I just can't wait to do the the whisker thing on the on the eye just oh I'm just I've got to be patient that's going to be the last thing all right Steve we'll see you soon Nanette, is this one of the awful Derwent pencils I am using? Yes, it is. <laughs> it is. And I'm using them. Because <laughs> of the colour. Although this one is not as scratchy on the surface. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just the way I... No, it can't be just me. <laughs> well then, yeah, you suppose you can blame it on the operator, eh? Or the artist. Serious? Okay. No, it's not the colour. See? It's not the colour. Oh, bugger. This is the colour that I want. <sighs> Don't know what to tell you.
for it, her for it. Where did it go? Okay, which way do they go? I'm just having a look at the fur, which way the fur is going. Sort of going everywhere, really. I think I'm nearly there with her on her face. Uh, maybe I'm just too impatient to put those nice whoosh, whoosh things. I don't know what you call them. I don't know. <laughs> Whiskers. That's something, isn't it? <laughs> what didn't I think of that? Okay, all right, let's work on this area here now. I'll probably come back up there, but let's just work on this area. Um, okay. Was interest uh, dark enough? Not dark enough. Hmm. Not 
dark enough. This is dark. Maybe. Heidi, okay, thank you so much for popping by. Bye for now. something a bit darker there. Why can't I get that dark? Don't really... <laughs> okay, well that's a good idea. Maybe I should get a cup of coffee now. Yeah. Alright. Shall I I'll just put down I'll put down like a little note. Um, say so just gone to get coffee how about that hang on here we go I'll be back <laughs> leave the music on
Okay. Ah, yes, coming back with fresh eyes. Can see lots of things to do. <laughs> hmm. Yes. Ah. Interesting what you see when you go away. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Should put it on that side, I think. So I don't spill it on this side. <laughs> Need to soften certain areas. do that now. This thing. Before I do that, this area just needs a little bit more of this ochre. softening certain areas. you right away from me. Just do it, Chrissy. Stop procrastinating. I'm procrastinating. <laughs> I'm not doing it. Oh, dear. I reckon this is worse than... Um, oh, I would need to give us some eyelashes as well. Okay, here we go. 
No. There we go, that's better. Not sure about that one. Hmm. That's better. Yes, that's better. Jeff, hello, dear. How oh, good I, Chrissy? Good I, everyone. Uh, Lady Lion, looking good, Chris. Thank you. How are you? It's been a while since I've seen you. Um, I did kitten whiskers today. I feel your pain. Yes. <laughs> oh, it's just that thing. Hey. All right. Here we go. I've got to do the same with these bloody things here. And I just, you know. Hang on. Let me just procrastinate a little bit more. Just give me some time. <laughs> missing something here. I know what I'm missing. There's this nice little pink bit. I don't know what you call that down here. It's down here. Summer. Some are white and some are dark. too much. she's looking like she's pretty done I don't know I'll well I think I, I, I mean I'll I'll yeah now let me work on 
the rest of this area here okay and then I'll keep on looking at her for a little while I think you know. all right let me just vacuum oh yeah I'm liking her I'm actually liking her. I really am. You know what? I've really enjoyed this. I don't know why I've enjoyed her so much. Oh, just um, yeah. I'm in love with her actually. Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I, yeah. Let me just um. I'll just vacuum the area so I can touch up the sky and things like that. So I just don't want you to subject it to the vacuum again. Hang on a sec. Oh, okay. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, I'm back. I'm back. Um, okay, you're on mute. Sorry, sorry. I'll go back and I'll say what I've said before. Um, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. So, um, looking at this now, uh, yeah, just wanted to say that um, in real life, this is much more vibrant than you're seeing on the screen. Uh, another thing that I because what I can see what you're seeing well maybe it's just my monitor I don't know but um, but I really like the way I've blended this part of her shoulder that goes into that um, you know that sky so I really like that so there's a few things and, and you know well maybe that's just me um, but um, I want to start touching things up um, and I'll work on the sky so um, so I can look at her again and see what needs to be done um, happy for you for you guys to you know give me feedback if you think I've missed anything or if you think that I can improve on this I'm always happy for you guys to tell me
uh, uh, this ear, okay, uh, this ear, this part of the ear or that one? The bottom one or the top one? Tell me which one. I think... The, uh, just tell me the top this the top bit or oh this one here oh yeah that one that one there uh, there right right in the middle of the oh that there okay uh, turn that down I think soften it hey you mean this the white one okay I'm um, okay I'm gonna point and then you tell me where all right okay so this this bit here that cloud is bothering you all this mass here oh my gosh This, this bit. I'm gonna white cloud. <laughs> this bit. Yes. Okay. This bit. Okay. This bit here. Oh. Okay. All right. All right. Gotcha. Okay. Let's just uh, change that then. I agree. All right. Yeah, because I can't see certain things. You know, when you look at things too long. Okay. Let's see if I can. The soft white cloud coming out of her ear. It's, it's this one. It's got to be this. <laughs> Hang on. Working on it, working on it. Uh, uh, note... Uh, raw umber desaturating a bright color just thought I'd mention that I talk about it a lot okay um, I think you have to back away for to see it um, it looks fine now okay oh hello Karen better hello Karen how are you going <laughs> nice to see you enough okay enough <laughs> okay Oh, that's it. <laughs> all right, okay. All right, all right. Okay. All right. Yeah, I think this is it. I really think this is it, actually. Um, I'm just getting all of these little white bit specks off. That's all I'm doing. I'm not doing anything else. Okay, that's it? Is that it? She's gonna sit on my on the easel for a little bit and probably just touch little things, not much, but I think we're done because I, I don't want to look at her anymore. I've, you know, she's been looking at me for too long. I think. Yes. Yes. No. Should I fix something here? Maybe. Um, just let me fix some of her hair. Maybe. Some of her hair here.
congratulations. First completed one live. Yeah, there you go. I know it doesn't happen very often, but let's just, shall we say, if we had sound effects, can we just go, you know, the, what is it? The applause? We, I think that is, um, <laughs> welcome. <laughs> All right. Okay. All right. I think it's, yeah, okay, I'm not going to fiddle with it too much. I think this is, um, uh, she looks sultry. Yes, yeah, she does, doesn't she? I think it's those, oh, hang on, she hasn't got eyelashes, bloody hell. You won't be able to see them, but, um, and you know what, a trick, when you've got a dark face like that, to give her eyelashes you go lighter see what I mean okay that's it that's it that's it no more don't touch I went too much over there but yeah. All right. <laughs> there you go, Karen. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. That's so funny. Oh my gosh. I love that. <laughs> Thanks, Karen. <laughs> yes, applause. Oh, you know, if I could bow, I will bow as well. <laughs> Those applause deserve a bow. <laughs> oh, geez. Okay. I think she is done. I think. Those whiskers just finish her off, doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah, I think so. Don't touch, she says as she reaches for another pencil. <laughs> Okay, well, okay, well, let me just sit with my cup of coffee and let's just have a look. I think I just will do that instead of picking up a pencil. How about that? Ah, oh, there you go. Thanks, Shandri. <laughs> hmm. Oh, wow. All right, I just might make... The, okay, look, no, I promise. <laughs> you know, just... <laughs> As I say that, I know. But I, I see that just a little bit darker underneath her chin um, Helen says great thank you Helen just underneath it just those dark bits you know just just a smidgen but none of this other business I'm not doing any more with this business yeah there you go Sally hello beautiful thank you so much <laughs> okay all right all right hang on All right, so I think that we are done. Yes, I'm happy. All right, I just wanted to say thank you so much for uh, for hanging out. You know, like I tried not to talk too much, but you know what I'm like. Just, I, I can't. No antlers? <laughs> or horns on this one? Nice. Okay, cool. <laughs> you know... You know what? There is what there is one coming up with all, with antlers. Yes, I can't get away from the horns. <laughs> I was going to say something. It was just not right. Actually, so I'm not going to say anything. But anyway, look, everyone, thank you so much. Um, appreciate you hanging around. See, finished it. Um, I'm going to be live streaming on Wednesday, so let's see what happens there. Okay, bye. Uh, please, everyone, have a nice week, and I'll talk to you. Uh, talk to you soon. Okay. All right. Let me see. Oop. Oh, sorry. Okay. Bye now.